What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to delete Google Documents in a book so how to massive delete Google Docs or delete a couple of Google Docs at once by default if you go to your Google Docs homepage just like here you cannot simply select one and select another, another, another to delete, to delete. So what we need to do and what you probably already have faced and can be a lot of time consuming, by the way, you need to find your doc, click into these three dots, click on remove, wait until removal, do the same with the other and this can take a lot of time okay and if you are just like me you want to organize the files and only keep the files that you need for okay so you may have to delete this at some point and how to do this without losing time and your patience okay so before anything please hit the subscribe button and like this video share with a friend of yours with your family because this content has some value and we, br we bring daily videos for wordpress usage tutorials guides seo marketing all about using internet on your favor can be found here on visual moto youtube channel so please hit the subscribe button and like this video okay so let's go to what we're gonna do before anything, we are, once you have a Google Docs, you have a Google Drive. It's the same account, okay? So move to your Google Drive account. Once on Google Drive account, in my case, the documents are shared with me. They are not written by me, but it can be in any place you want. I'm here on my Google Drive now. And once on Google Drive, I can now select click into a doc, use shift to select others and use delete to remove all of the files. In the case that you want to do the process faster, you can click right here into the, to the grid view so we can change the, the view style. Okay, so at the top right corner of your screen next to your Google image, go right here and click into the grid view. Now you can select a lot of files. Just like here. And then click on delete in your keyboard. Remember to use a shift. Okay. And or click with the right button of your mouse and remove. Simple, fast, easy. And effective there is other ways sure you can use the control and select one by one so we can jump some parts for example let's imagine that I want to keep this one I'm gonna select one hold the control button and click to select only the ones that I want to delete after the ones properly clicked go to remove if by mistake you did delete some of the documents, some of the files by mistake, have a look at the left side of your bars into the Google Drive. Go to the trash and here you can restore the files, okay? By clicking with the right button of your mouse over the hidden, you can delete forever or restore. Remember that in 30 days, okay, all the files gonna be deleted automatically by Google if you move them to trash, okay? So you have 30 days to restore the files that you do not want to leave. And you can repeat the process until you have deleted all of the files that you no longer need. And it is in this way you're gonna be able to organize your Google documents easier and it is I hope you guys enjoyed this video 
feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmodel.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes. And in the case that you are in need of doing AR first or upgrading your website to create your online presence for your business, for example, go to wordpress.org, search for Enzo WordPress theme or search for borderless WordPress plugin. They are both for free. You can download and install on your WordPress and have amazing tools to create your website for free. So you're going to be able to build amazing pages without spending money. Okay. And in addition, in the case that you are in need of learning something new, go to your, go to visual Moto YouTube channel or go to visualmoto.com and review our blog. We bring daily posts on there as well for a lot of topics. So you can learn every day from us. I'm gonna leave some links into the video description and the first comment of this video for very useful sources. For example, a place where you can purchase a domain name for 99 cents, a place where you can upgrade your hosting plan and save money while you're doing this, and a place where you can download design assets. For example, Photoshop templates, icons, fonts, and they update the downloadable design assets every week. And you can do this for free. And that is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you find this content useful, please share with a friend of yours, with your family. Leave a comment below in the case that you have any question, video idea, or want to start a discussion. I'm going to be happy to talk to you. So, that is. I see you later. All the best.